welcome to another exciting video from Gobbler Ridge Farms and fresh from Texas I have a special guest we call her Survival Rosie. I'm not Survival Rosie. <laughs> You're not Survival Rosie? No. Okay well she's not because we haven't taught her. Anyway we were on a uh, on a camping trip if you call camping in an RV camping I know how that could be but uh, we were out uh, there to kayak on the lake and uh, this past weekend we were going up a beaver slough in our kayaks and lo and behold hanging over the the creek there was a dead piece of willow and i've been wanting to do friction fire with uh, uh willow and uh you know just i like to do it with as many different woods as possible and uh so that i you know have that experience when i get out of the woods and know different things to look for and rosie has never seen anybody make a friction fire before so i didn't bring my lighter you, you didn't bring your lighter well you're in luck because <laughs> <laughs> because i brought a couple of sticks all right so let me get the spindle on there now i did make an ember the other day but at the uh, campsite one of our little hacks for doing a uh uh, a campfire is we bring some dryer lint along with us to uh, get the fire started there in the fire ring and I uh, thought I might go ahead and just it was getting dark so I thought I'd do a quick video on it and apparently there was some polyester fabric poly cotton mixed in with the dryer lint and it melted on my ember so I did get a first ember or an ember on my first try with this but let's see if we can blow it to fire today all right start building up a little heat what we want to do is get some this dust is going to fill into this little pie shape thing that i cut in my fireboard and once the, hey no barking on the scent you can't interrupt your barking peaches oh she might hear the squeaking of the wood all right see the smoke hey you might not need a lighter. Now I'm gonna go fast. Now I'm trying to build up some heat. See how it's kind of red and glowing? That means it's ready to start be blowing the fire. That'd be real good. You're all fired. See that? Rosie, you're not looking. You're gonna burn it. my hand off. I saw it. But you don't you didn't need to bring your lighter today. Woohoo! We can have hot dogs. They keep barking. It will be a hot dog in a Alright. We made a fire. We made a fire. Alright. Hey, you're getting off the camera there, girl. I gotta teach you to be a YouTube star and a bushcraft aficionado. Yeah, this is a bad video. We're gonna have to redo this. <laughs> I don't know if I can edit this 
<laughs> out to be good. But anyway, uh, this is a piece of willow uh, that I got. It's a, uh, it's kind of a soft hardwood, but it, it made a fireboard. Uh, it, it was great to work with, a true soft uh, hardwood. And as you can see, it blew into flame pretty quick. So if you're out in the wild and you need a star fire, add willow to your list of resources to be on the lookout for. All right, that's going to do it for this exciting video from Gobbler Ridge Farms. I'll see all you turkeys on the next one. <coughs> Smokey the bear and peaches the chihuahua. So don't forest start fires. don't start forest fires. <laughs> well what'd you think? I'm not, Fire? Cut, I'm not cut out for YouTube. Fire from a, from a stick. You were fine. The dogs? Nah, not so much.